Hey, what's up guys? Uh, Sweet again. Um, this is going to be a guide just for uh, Thinner Ventrilo. Um, just for the admins. Just uh, If you don't know how to work your way around the user editor, hopefully this will help you out. Um, on this left hand side here, uh, you got all the names of everyone that's added to the server. So if you wanted to go like edit someone, uh, Say you want to make a new person, um, and Jay, this will help you out because um, I'll show you how to do like load a profile, so you don't have to check everything. So say you want to um, add a new person, you're gonna go here, you're gonna type in a login name, of whatever the guest account may be. Type in their desired password, and then uh, here you're gonna go through the ranks and find their combat, either. Uh, it's just if it's uh, if they're just for theory for the Cobbler's clan, I'm just gonna do regular clan member. If they're from Defiance, do Defiance. So I'll put 121 clan member for myself. And then um, just watch what boxes I check, and this is what you should check for everyone. to get in this is how you add it so if the person has 85 range at least uh, you click on armadillo and you click add they should be able to do bandos if they're on 15 plus they should be able to do zami as well and if they have 70 agility you add the serodome and then you can add god works for everyone uh, there should be a quarter channel here it's not here right now, I got deleted for some reason. That will be back up eventually. Um, if they're from Defiance, you go ahead and add the Defiance channels, all three of them. Um, and never do that. Just leave that alone, that's for guests, and just leave that there. We don't want members in the guest channel. Alright, so say you did all this, and uh, you don't want to go through for every new person you make and check every box. Well, that's where this profile scene comes in. Once you've checked all, this, all these uh, boxes, you're going to go up here to save as. And then you can put anything. Put it as test rank. Um, so now what you do is, uh, I'm going to go out of the user editor. Or I'm going to just click new again. So it's all brand new. Nothing is done. So I'm gonna go put my login name again. Put my rank. And uh, I'm gonna go to load. Wait. You're gonna go from to the uh, drop down on profiles. And uh, this is the rank I just made, test rank. I'm gonna click that, select that, and then go to load. So now. All these boxes are checked. I don't have to bother with checking them. This is everything that I checked on the last time. And then uh, you still have to add the channel authorization every time, but that's not really a big deal since it differs for everyone anyway. That's pretty much it. Just makes it a hell of a lot easier when you're adding a new person. Down, you just click add, go down here, and I'm added in. So, let me open another vent here. Here's your name, sweet tooth phone. Change my password.
that's pretty much it. Um, now say, uh, say you want to go in the user editor and change change something on someone. Like this guy, he's uh, he's not from Defiance. So I want to change his rank because right now it's telling me that he's in Defiance and he's 118 combat. But I know for a fact he's not Defiance. For that, um, you're going to go in the user editor. Find his name, just all the way at the top. Too good for you, 50. Right on the rank, uh, you just uh, go, fix the rank, and then you're gonna click the update, and then the changes should be made. And uh, over here, let's pull down. And now it's just 118, not 118 defiance. So, um, basically, whenever you're trying to make a change to someone, just make whatever changes you need in the user editor. Then click update, and then it'll work. So that's pretty much it. That's my guide on kind of navigating yourself around the user editor. Pretty much just takes time, like, messing around with it. I'm, I'm still learning shit about Van. Just gotta keep doing it. Keep finding new shit out. Uh, hope it helped, and see ya.